voices in my head, they counsel me, they understand, they talk to me. Hey there lovelies, today I am going to be talking about human rights and feminism. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, for the sake of everything holy, never, ever do that again. Ooh, ooh. If I'm looking down a lot in this video, it's because my computer is here. I'm going to be reading some things, so I don't have the table here. So that is why. So I sent out a, what is that, a Google survey to my whole school. And so I got it was about civil rights and human rights. The different questions were, what do you think civil rights are? Do you consider yourself a feminist? Why or why not? Um, do you believe that all humans... Oh my god, I cannot talk today. Then start learning how to edit your videos, because then you can not make mistakes. Seriously, it's the best way to do so. You know, to make yourself a little more professional, if you know what I mean. Or read. I am dyslexic. Do you believe that all human beings deserve equal rights? Um, why or why not? <laughs> and so I'm going to read you some of the responses and why I think they are incredibly dumb. I'm going to have to grab a big fucking mirror for you to, for you, because the things that you say should apply to only you. You are the idiot. Trust me when I say this. It's gonna be, it's gonna get ugly. So most of these responses that I got when I said, do you consider yourself a feminist? Most people said yes, which makes me really, really happy inside. Happy, happy, joy, joy, happy, happy, joy, joy. Because it's a really good thing. And then there were the people that said no. Most of them are uneducated people that said no and then when they said why or why not they said because I'm a guy because I'm a boy because I don't know what it is <sighs> I agree that you do not necessarily have to be a female in order to be a feminist but being a male feminist has some of the ridiculous uh, standards there is trying to reach a female feminist uh, standards is incredibly Difficult. It's not impossible, but it's incredibly fucking difficult. It's like walking through a minefield without a mine detector, and there's a wall pushing you forward. If you don't move forward, the mo the wall's gonna push you forward. And if you step one of those mines, you're pretty much fucking dead. In the feminist case, they'll consider you a misogynist, or as bad as Adolf Hitler. You know, th these are how bad these feminists have become. The only way to win is to avoid a minefield at all costs. In other words, avoid feminism at all costs. So, if you don't, if you're watching this video and you don't know what feminism, the little feminism, if you don't know what feminism is, please go educate yourself first. Wow, i never seen a feminist so freaking lazy to just say feminism just means equality. It's Or get a fucking dictionary and just say that this is what the, the meaning of feminism is. Can't take 10 seconds to do so. Hell, I'll give the other feminists out there some form of credit who continue to say that feminism means equality. Uh, those who uses the fucking dictionary at least... At least they took the time to look up the fucking definition, but you, you just say, fuck it. Fuck you, you gotta do it yourself. Here, go, shoot. Before you watch this video, just go pause it, go, go look it up. The other responses, I'm gonna read you like two specific ones on here that I really, that really made me mad. So this one person, they know what civil rights is. Civil rights is the right that everyone has to be equal no matter what race, gender, religion, or sexuality. And that is basically what civil rights is. So then they said they weren't a feminist, which made me really confused because this seems like a relatively educated person. Someone that's educated and opposing feminism? No. 
that knows that people should have equal rights. And they said that they weren't a feminist. And then they said this. A feminist is technically an individual who supports women's rights. Keyword, women's rights. However, it seems to have taken on a completely new meaning and goal that I don't support. I support women's rights and women's equality. But most feminists believe in complete feminine superiority. Which I have seen with the very two eyes that I have. They often look down upon men, which isn't right, and I believe that women are not superior to men, men aren't superior to women. Everyone should be created equal. But chances are you consider almost every man to be a potential rapist. Come on, we all know where this is going. Equality is equality, and everyone has a place. No one person or gender is more important than another, and feminists have a distorted view of this. I don't know if this is anonymous or not, but I think it is important that I am female myself. These are my true thoughts. So this person, they are a feminist. Bullshit! This person is not a feminist just because this person believes in equality. Feminists do not own the concept of equality. I don't know how many times I have to stretch this out towards many, 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 many feminists. You do not own the concept of equality. You can still be in favor of equality and still be not a feminist. You can be an equalist, a humanist. Those are not just the only group of people that support equality outside of feminism, you know. Seriously, stop trying to make feminism look like this extremely cool and awesome place. Uh, this awesome group of people that just wants to have fun. They don't like to admit that they are a feminist, but they believe in equality for both genders, so they are a feminist. HOLY FUCK IS THIS WRONG! This person is a female, which made me very confused. I know! A female that is opposing feminism? No. They... <sighs> uh, did you just take a shit in your bedroom? So... I just... My question to this person would be... Would... Do you want to get paid the same as your male counterpart doing the exact same job as you? Do you want to be treated equally to a man of a man? Do you do you want the same rights? Do you want to be able to do the exact same things as them in the exact same ways? I just don't understand where some people are coming from here. Of course you don't understand because you never bother to understand why. They then said that they do believe that all humans deserve equal rights. If you believe that, you are a feminist. HOLY FUCK IS THIS WRONG! I am going to end up using that clip a lot, aren't I? This one made me really, really mad. This person said that civil rights was a natural born right of every human. More or less, yes. Um, but then they said that they are not a feminist, and then they had the nerve to say this. How dare they? Feminists are pieces of crap. I am female, but they are horribly stupid. In quotation marks, he looked at me. That's rape. End quotation. Nah, man. K-Y-S. What is with the slow-mo? period. Whoever you may be in the world, you are stupid. Pot calling the kettle black much? Okay, you are the piece of crap here. Not, feminists are not the piece of crap. People that want to be created equal to someone else, that is not being a piece of crap. Uh -huh. <laughs> You are stupid.
head. You putting other people down for wanting equal rights? That makes you a piece of crap. Because opposing feminism means that you oppose equality, you hate women, you hate children, you want to kill old babies, you want to rape children, you're, you're worse than Adolf Hitler, etc, etc, etc. I've heard this a thousand fucking times. And let me just tell you, I am judging a movement based on its actions, not by its meaning, okay? I don't give a flying fuck if feminism means that it gives you the power of immortality. What I care is the actions. And so far, the actions do not equal the meaning. Think. I just drool. Th yeah, I just drool. Thanks. To and we... Okay, so the whole he looked at me, that's rape thing, there's no one, no one's going to be like, yeah, maybe catcalling, you, that should not be done anyway. Catcalling is nothing more than fucking words, words, fucking words. I can understand if someone's pestering you, but all it is, is just Words. He didn't look at you. If someone just looks at you on the street, yeah, okay. They looked at you. No. One particular video completely disagrees with your statement. Apparently, we cannot even look at a woman nowadays. No one's gonna get mad about that. But if he says something to you, or does something dumb like that, then it's, it's not rape, it's sexual harassment. They're two different things. Educate yourself. There's gotta be a big fucking mirror around here. This person also said one of the things was what do you think this school could do better to make sure everyone is treated equally? They said discipline people that aren't following the dress co code and are really annoying. You, my friend, you are the annoying one. Okay, I got a little present for you, okay? Okay? See that mirror right there? See it? That mirror is for you, okay? You, you see it? You see it? You see it? You see that fucking mirror? Do you see it? Because, you know, that mirror right there is for you. You, right there, are a big, fat hypocrite. Look at that mirror. Look at it. It's for you. You are a big, fat hypocrite! I can't stand people. Okay, so if you say you... There's no justifying if you say, I am not a feminist, but... Oh, no, no, no. There's justification for that. Lots of it. Lacey Green made this point in one of her videos, and it is the best point in the world. So this person said, I defend women's rights and stand up against anti-feminists slash sexist. Lacey Green barely defends her own statements. Her her videos are easily being able to torn apart. It's it's her arguments is as strong as a house made out of fucking glass. But I am not active in the feminist world. You don't have to go protest for for women's rights or send petitions and stuff make send petitions? Write petitions? I don't know. But you don't have to do all that stuff to be considered a feminist. You just, you just have to be one. You just have to think that women are created equal to men. This one's, this one is really, really long, so I'm not going to read it. Um, I'll put it in the description, in the description below. My friend Kate wrote it, and it is, it is beautiful, <laughs> and I love it so much. Look, I'll make it easier for myself. Okay? Feminism. Feminism, I mean, I could write you... Oh, good work with the spelling. Write you a thousand-page novel on why it's beautiful. But, feminism originally was f about fighting for equal rights. Was. Keyword was. Today, we see this across nations, races, classes, sexual orientation, age. Feminism is fighting its fight against sex trafficking and child bribes and rape and violence and women being the battlefield against war. Uh, the, the major hypocrisy about this part is that men are being used as tools for war. 
But no, 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 no. It, it's 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 basically women. You know, as soon as you bring a woman into this shit, it's completely horrible. But as long as it's just men, then we can duke it out. We can kill each other, rape each other. It doesn't matter. But holy shit, if it's a woman, then we should all go ape shit. It's against blatant misogyny and ignorance. We see how it's, it, it, is, it is, has improved by just looking at propaganda, books, society from the 70s, and how far it has to go. It's not going, it's not going to go far at this rate. Today, it's about oppression. From girls in Saudi Arabia to here, women are equal in, here in America. We have a long way to go. In America, it's about gender roles. So, if some man wants to be a cook, then fine. If some woman wants to be a NASCAR driver, fine. No one is forcing you to do so. Homophobia, that we can agree. Classism, reproductive rights, hobby lobby, abortion, breastfeeding, misogyny. There's very little misogyny going on. The pay gap, the fucking pay gap. I fucking hate it. Fucking hate it, fucking hate it with great hatred. Words alone cannot express how much I hate that fucking argument. I've been proven, disproven. I hate it. Just fucking hate it. You bring up that fucking argument, I'm not even bothered to address it anymore. Okay? I'm tired of that shit. I'm tired of the fucking wage gap argument. Let's just move on. It's just. Stupid, and it's wrong. The glass ceiling. Ignorance. Rape culture. There's no fucking rape culture. Okay? The Amazing Atheist has already made a video about rape culture and how it doesn't exist. Our beauty industry. What the hell does the beauty industry have to do with anything? Propaganda. Catcalling. Again, with the fucking catcalling. It's just words. Double standards like you fucking feminists do all the fucking time. Slut shaming. Sexual objectification. Listen to me. There's nothing wrong with being sexually objectified. It's part of human nature. Men get object sexually objectified as well. But you feminists do not give a shit about it. Okay. If you believe that no one should be objectified, then you are absolutely wrong. Everyone is going to be objectified. I am being objectified right now because I am nothing more than mere entertainment towards my fans. The people that like me, the people who dislike me, the people who are indifferent to me, I am nothing more than plain, simple entertainment that people can look at, they can laugh at, for people to dislike, to... Uh, you know, to masturbate to, if people want to masturbate to me, then that's fucking fine. Whatever they doing behind their laptops or computers, I don't give a shit. If you masturbate to me, I, I won't judge you, okay? I won't fucking judge you if you masturbate towards my voice, my face. If you think, if you find a toy and you put a picture of my face and, and ha decide to have sex with it, that's your choice, okay? It, it's, it's just how it works. Asking for it. Girls not in STEM programs. Ironically, there's also a big double standard there because uh, apparently having an all boys club is evil, but, uh, you know, a boy trying to enter an all girls club is really just evil itself. You know, it's bad to have an old boys club, but to have an old girls club is completely fine. Being called bossy, I knew it. I fucking knew it. <laughs> bossy is nothing wor more than a word. A fucking word. Like, <laughs> you girls cannot handle a single fucking word. How can we expect you to be... You know, just as strong as independent as any man, if you cannot even handle the single word bossy. How can we believe that shit? How can we believe that you are equal footing on us, with us, if you cannot handle the word bossy? Fix that station on body image, being stuck in role sexism, yada yada yada. It ends there. All I have to say is, B 
BULLSHIT! So, that is just the beginning part. I'm not gonna read the whole thing, because it is really long. But, I just want all of you to know that feminism is not a bad thing. If you believe that women are created equal, you need to stand up for that. You need to shout it from the mountaintops. No, we fucking don't! It's not about equality! We we just established this shit, okay? We oppose feminism because of the hypocritical double standards. Understand? That I am a feminist. It's a good thing. HOLY FUCK IS THIS WRONG! It's not like, oh, I'm a feminist, but you know, I don't... I don't consider myself a feminist. You know, this is on par with that same girl who says, I'm for equality, but I'm also against equality. As if saying that, once again, that feminism owns the concept of equality when it does not. Opposing feminism does not mean that you oppose women's rights. And I already explained this to Hobbes, that you cannot have... Uh, uh, feminism is not as simple as joining, uh, just jumping on the boat. It's not as simple as just believing in, in equality. But, uh, but the, the, the double standards with Hobbes is that he's trying to explain that this person is absolutely right when, 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 in a nutshell, she's just saying that feminism means equality. And it's just as simple as that. But feminism is not just a simple, uh, just a simple belief in equality. You have to believe in the fucking patriarchy, which I do not believe in. There is no fucking patriarchy going on in America. At this point, you might as well just start making conspiracy theories. Yeah, just complete, utter conspiracy theories. Take the blue pill. Take the blue pill. Just because other people tell you that being a feminist is bad, it's a really good thing. HOLY FUCK IS THIS WRONG! Have you ever even seen any anti-feminist videos on YouTube? Chances are that you haven't. Okay, you, you haven't bothered to look at Thunderfoot's videos, you haven't bothered to look at uh, The Amazing Atheist, Mr. Repsion, uh, Sargon of Akkad, um, Skeptor. Some of these are great YouTubers. And, oh yeah, and Warcorp666. That guy's awesome, you know. Subscribe to him. He, he drinks lots of beer. Most of the time, he's uh, pretty freaking sober. But he needs to drink beer because that's his fuel to stay on this planet with complete sanity. Do you not at least try to understand why people oppose feminism? At least try? Chances are that you haven't. You haven't tried at least once. Just stand up for what you believe in and you'll go really far and hopefully you'll change the world. HOLY FUCK IS THIS WRONG! Alright, so don't forget to subscribe if you liked the video. Go like it and rate it and comment what you thought about it down below. And well, here's some food for thought. You are a total complete biased moron. I think I might need to, you know, buy you a big ass mirror for you to look at and stare as long as possible to reflect on what the hell you are saying, you hypocritical piece of filth. I am the Atheist Gamer. Peace the game out. And all my social media links are down there, Twitter, Tumblr, Instagram. I think I have some other ones. So, I will see y'all later. I don't want to live on this planet anymore. If you enjoy watching this video, click on the like button. Subscribe to this channel for more videos. And of course, you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and ugh, Google+.
We all know Google Plus fucking sucks.